Are you prone to chunking the ball? Do you take these big, deep divots that you really don't want to be seen taking out in the golf course, that you're shying away when you see the greenkeeper, so you don't want to see him damaging his, uh, his fairway? If so, then this tip is going to help you improve your ball striking. So, what I want you to do is get the ball with a middle iron initially, so maybe a six or a seven iron, and just tee it up, just a, a nice low tee. And what I want you doing is standing, practicing, clipping the ball off the top of that tee. Okay, these deep divots are coming, generally speaking, where a player is using the arms too much and are chunking down, swinging steeply with the arms into the turf. If you do that when the ball is on the tee, you just will not make any strike on the golf ball. It will come off the top of the face and there'll be a real uh, poor flight to the ball. So what I want you to feel as you've got this ball pegged up is you feel a synchronization between your arms and your body through the impact zone. So we have body and arms moving together and we're just clipping. Now initially, do this with a fairly smooth swing, not trying to put too much force in the ball and just wanting to feel a fairly shallow angle into the ball. So if I hit a couple away from you, so I get set up, ball is on my low tee and we clip them off the tee. Okay, do that once again. So you'll notice that I'm not heading down into the turf. Now, if you're prone to hitting the ball thin, okay, do not try this. This is absolutely not the drill for you. But for the guy, another girl who hits these deep divots, let's work on this one. Low tee peg, we get the body and the arms working together. We clip the ball off the tip of the tee, okay? If when you're hitting this shot, you make your bad swing, you get the arms working too much, what you're gonna see is a real steep downswing angle, chunk into the turf, restricted follow through, and the ball comes right off the top of the club face. Now, that is not gonna give you any consistency on the golf course. You're gonna struggle to control the distance of your shots. You're gonna struggle to control the direction. And if you've got hard ground like we've got just now, you're gonna get some pretty sore wrists and potentially a golfer's elbow come tennis elbow there. So let's work on clipping this ball off the tee. Peg it up, body and arms work together. Clip and through. As you feel you're hitting them quite well, at that point, you can begin to increase the club head speed and the force and the power just that little bit. But always make sure that as you do so, it's not a whip of the arms, but rather the body and the arms working together. That gives us the correct angle of attack and will allow us to clip that ball off the tee without digging into the turf. I hope that helps. Get out there, get practicing, and let's hope you get some nice, clean strikes.